Hey y'all, this is the last day of Teacher Appreciation Week and there are many teachers who have been a huge influence on me and uh, my new career path. Um, I won't even, well I'll take that back, I won't say new career path because in some capacity I've always been in this career and it's just evolving. So um, my spiritual gift, among others, but my, my greatest gift is the gift of teaching. That's not just teaching the word, which is scripture of the Bible, but also teaching in other capacities. So um, some of the teachers I'd like to acknowledge, um, God, it's really hard to remember people when you want to start listing out who and what they've done. Um, my grandmother, for being the first Sunday school teacher I ever had, uh, she taught me prayers and a lot of things that my mother, God rest her soul, uh, continued to develop and instill within myself and my younger sister. Um, from there, my aunts, who always taught me that there is always something to laugh at, to put a smile on your face. One of my aunts also really uh, increased my imagination by making Mrs. Butterworth bottles speak to me when I was a little girl. And that counts as teaching, definitely, because I wouldn't be where I am now if it wasn't for the capacity to dream big. Um, Mrs. Washington, Lavinia Washington, she was my first grade teacher and she was amazing. She had to deal with me in her class having to do asthma breathing treatments and all kind of extra things that she went above and beyond to make sure I was healthy and able to participate with the students in my class. Um, my step teacher in middle school who believed that I could learn any dance routine or any step routine just by watching it one time and could teach it to everyone else, which to this day is still kind of true. Um, to the amazing teachers at Cass Tech in Detroit. Um, wow. Some of y'all I'm still very, very much in touch with. Um, from no more sass in my class, Senorita. Mr. Dunmore, who I feel like I learned nothing from in Spanish class. Um, he always believed in my artistic capacity. And every time I came back to visit Kaz, he always made an effort to say something to me. And despite my feelings about him, uh, I appreciate you. Um, Miss Green, Mama Hooks in my book. Y'all know I love her. There's nothing to Additionally, say past that, love her to death. Um, <laughs> there was a Miss Thomas, who I'm not in touch with anymore, but she believed in my creative writing capacity, and she'd be pleased now to see all the things that I've written. Um, Mr. Otulakowski, <laughs> the one teacher at Cast Tech who would straight up curse me out because I would just go against the grain to frustrate him. Um, I love you too. <laughs> and Mr. Anthony Smith, the dance teacher at Cass, uh, you, God gave it back to me. That's all I can say without tearing up. Um, to Miss Keisha, Miss Camille, two of my favorite dance teachers in Detroit, to, oh gosh. I don't remember any of the teachers at Bowling Green State University. There's probably a reason for that. But I do remember one teacher I had for political science who went ham on us about an exam. He left an amazing impression on me. Um, there's been many others along the way. And to keep this video from being so long, I won't sit and tag them out. But it is two more. I need to squeeze in there. One, my cousin. Ida Carter, she is awesome. I get to sit in on her classes, and that's a cobweb. <laughs> I get to sit in on her classes at her high school and watch her blow these little kids' minds, and she got Teacher of the Year, and she's getting ready to prepare herself to be a principal, and I'm so proud of her, and it's so awesome. And finally, uh, Ejen, she 
Sansei Nim, my Korean teacher, for taking on a little black girl who wants to embrace a whole nother language and be able to go halfway across the world and teach English and share God's love with those kids. So if you're a teacher, you are impactful. Our lives would not be what they are without you all caring the way that you do. And I'm honored, I'm so honored to be developing myself as a teacher for future generations. I love y'all. Bye, y'all.